Hello everyone, welcome to D4 Drupal channel. Today we are going to see about how to use login redirect, login logout redirect module based on the role. So the module name is login logout redirect for role Drupal. So this is the module. So login, logout, redirect per role. So based on the role, how to redirect a user on the login or logout page, okay? So let's see how to do this. For that first, you have to download this module. So I'm going to use Composer to download it. So Composer require group all slash the module name. So enter. So now we downloaded the model successfully. So after that, we have to go to the extend page and type login. So login and logout redirect per role. So now we have successfully enabled the module. So next, what we have to do, we have to move to the configuration page of this module. So, so here you have a configuration page and here you have to mention the URL which you want to move, okay? Before that, you have to rearrange the roles here because uh, you can see the working logic here. So which means what they are saying here is that let me show, tell you with notepad. So when a user has two roles, okay? So consider role is editor and reviewer. He has both role, okay? So now he has both role. So in the configuration, even though reviewer is at the top, reviewer is at the top and editor is next to it. So if the, uh, in configuration, if it is like that, in configuration, if it is arranged like this means when user login or logout. So if user has reviewer role, it will not check for editor role URL URL. So when a user has in any user has reviewer role, it will not check for the editor role, which means which role has priority that settings will be considered when the user login or redirect. Okay, so let me showcase how it is working and uh, let me showcase with the single role also. Okay, first, what we have to do authentic first, let's rearrange administrator should be at the top, and next is content editor, and I'm going to do the same in this logout settings also okay so here also administer should be at the top authenticated as should be at the below okay so let's give the url so let's save this and create one content or we'll use the same existing content also okay so we have a lot of content here so let's take node slash six Okay, so first, I'm going to mention this for content editor. Let's see it for content editor. So when the content editor logs in, this user will be redirected to the node slash six page. Okay, and um, when the same user logs out, he will be redirected to the node slash five. Okay. And I'm going to save it. So now we saved it for the content editor, node slash six and node slash five. Okay. Let's see whether we have content user for the content editor. Okay, there is a user called Saranya. So I don't remember the password. So let's change the password here. And login. 
who's a page. Okay, now Sarini is going to log in and Sarini is a content editor. So when you log in, you can see the user is uh, redirected to node slash six. Okay, if the same user is going to log out, he will be redirected to node slash four. Okay, so this works as per our configuration. Okay, so next we have one more settings called allow destination, right? So let's see what allow destination is. So this is what the page. So here you have an option called allow destination. So I'm going to enable allow destination for this and for this too, okay? And I'm going to showcase how it is working here, okay? So now the user is logged out successfully. So I'm going to again hit on login page with some destination. Destination equal to, I'm going to move this user to user page. So since it's localhost, I'm adding the folder name also here, slash user. So I'm now in URL, we have a destination, right? So I'm going to log in as Sarinya again. So now you can see it's not redirected as to the node slash 12, sorry, 6. It's redirected as to the user page, okay? So here, there is a uh, logout link, right? User slash logout. So let's hit the logout URL without our with the destination, okay? Destination, destination, okay, equal to Mm, slash name. Let's keep it slash name. Okay. Sorry, we have to mention the folder name. Drupal hyphen nine point four point five. So now you can see it's redirected us to the node page. Okay. So this is done. So let me show you one more thing. So let me add one more rule here as a reviewer. Okay. Content reviewer. And I'm going to save it. So reviewer will be. Okay, let's rearrange in that settings. So now I'm mentioning reviewer should be higher than editor. Okay. So let's do it only for the login. So it will be same for logout also. So in login, I'm mentioning he should be redirected to node slash some other node ID. We'll take it from here. Node slash four. Okay. Node slash four. Okay. I'm mentioning node slash four for him, content reviewer. So after that, I have to assign the role to the Saranya. Right. So let's edit the user and add reviewer role to the reviewer to her. So now the Saranya user has two roles one is a editor and one is a reviewer. So let's log in and check where it is redirecting, whether it's four or whether it's six. Let's see how it is working now. So let's log in. So Saranya A. See, it's redirected you to the node slash four. Here, the reviewer role is working, the uh, editor role is not working because we gave the priority to the reviewer role here, not for the editor, right? So when the user has multiple roles, you have to prioritize the redirection by using this feature, weight of the role, okay? And um, that's it. And coming to your configuration, so when you use this module, so you will be having a only one OML file for this to move your configuration. And that is login redirect control. So only this is required to move your configuration. And for module enabling, you have to move the four dot extension file. Okay. Here it will here it will have a record for what are the modules enabled. So we need to enable the login login redirect module. So you need to pass it and then that too. Okay. And these two modules are required for this module to move your configuration. And that's it about today's session. Hope everyone likes it. If you like the video, please share, like, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye.